Hey guys, my name is Dan, I'm a veterinarian. Today, Melody and Mary are going to walk us through a blood glucose check in a ferret. Blood glucose checks are really important, especially in ferrets with insulinomas. So Cheese has had insulinoma for a couple years now, so she is very used to this process. And um, we're very careful with her, and she's due for a blood glucose check at this time. So um, Mary is going to hold her in a way where I can ex access the back foot and just do a very gentle um, pin prick. So you want to have your glucometer at the ready um, because you don't need very much blood at all. And then you're actually gonna set it to the dog setting um, for these guys. I wanna go kind of at the side, a little pin prick, and then you're gonna go ahead and squeeze just a little bit out very gentle and then you're gonna go ahead and press your strip and you're gonna apply it to both sides and her blood glucose is at 66 ferrets normal blood glucose ranges are the same as dogs and cats so ideally we would want her blood sugar to be between 100 to 120 but we know that her um, sh sugars are constantly low due to her insulinoma, but this is actually higher than she's been. She's usually in the 30s or 40s, so we keep making adjustments to try to make her feel better every day. So uh, the technicians went ahead and they got this kid some, uh, some NutriCal, get that sugar up, and um, they check on this little ferret. daily, multiple times a day, um, just to make sure that blood glucose is uh, stable because we do have an insulinoma and we got to keep a close eye on that blood glucose to make sure it doesn't drop too low. So it is definitely a labor of love.